Hey what's up you guys, my name is Emily and in this video I'm going to show you how to make 3 marble room decoration ideas. In the comments down below, let me know what you think about these room decoration ideas and if you like this video, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for some more videos like this. Let's get on with the video. The first idea I'm going to show you is a pencil holder. What you will need for this idea is a tin can, scissors, a pencil, a ruler, a glue gun, and you will need to print out some marble onto some photo paper or normal paper, and both types of paper will work fine for this idea. The first thing you want to do is that if you happen to have no marble around the marble that you printed out, you want to cut around the marble to cut the blank paper off. And then you want to place the can at the top of the back of the piece of paper and mark where you would like the marble to stop with a pencil. Now you can take a ruler and measure from the top of the paper to the mark so you can put another mark on the other side of the paper. And then you can draw a straight line from mark to mark with the ruler and the pencil. Now you can cut on the line to get a strip of paper to go around the tin can. The last thing you have to do is to place the can in the middle on the back of the marble paper and take the glue gun and put a line of glue on the can and take one side of the strip of paper and put it onto the glue. Do the same thing for the other side of the strip of paper. Now the can is done and you can put anything that you want into the can. For the second idea I'm going to show you is this frame art idea. What you'll need for this idea is a frame, scissors, a pencil, and for the design that goes into the frame, you want to make the image in Canva, PicMonkey, or any design program will work. With a marble background, enter the picture and print it off. The first thing you want to do is trace the front or the back of the frame around the design. You cut the extra paper you don't want off, so it can fit into the frame. Now all you have to do is to put it into the frame and put it anywhere you would like on your desk or your wall. For the last idea, I'm going to show you this tray idea. What you will need for this idea is a tray, one or more pieces of marble paper. It will depend on the size of your tray for the amount of pieces of marble paper that you will need to print out. I used two pieces of marble paper for mine. You will also need scissors, a pencil, tape, and a ruler. And if you want, you can also paint the tray any color that you want. The first thing you want to do is to cut around the extra paper that's not marble off. And make sure you try to keep the size of the paper even. Then you want to place one of the pieces of paper into the tray and mark off how much you need to cut off with a pencil. Now you can take a ruler and make a straight line for how much you need to cut off and cut the extra paper off. For the second paper, you can just trace the first piece of paper around the back of the next piece of paper and cut the extra paper off. Now you want to place both pieces of paper into the tray and make sure they fit into the tray and you want to see where you want the paper to line up in the middle. Then you want to cut off the extra paper you don't want so it blends together in the middle. If you want you can put some paper under the marble paper so you don't see the bottom of the tray. The last thing you have to do is to tape, or you can also glue the paper onto the bottom of the tray, and if you put the paper behind the marble paper, make sure you tape that paper down too. Make sure where the marble meets is taped down flat. Now you can put anything that you want onto the tray, like your necklaces or books. And that's it for this video. In the comments down below, let me know what you think about these room decoration ideas. And if you liked this video, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for some more videos like this. I will see you in the next video. Bye!